The top 10 rock albums of 1988. Number 10, Green River, Rehab Doll. Grade, B-. This grunge band is now more famous for its members that later formed the bands Mud Honey and Pearl Jam, but their only album is good, especially one song that borrows from an early Blue Oyster Cult song. Standout tracks, Swallow My Pride, Take a Dive. Number 9, Guns N' Roses, GNR Lies, Grade, B-. A strange follow-up to their all-time classic debut, with fake live songs from an earlier EP mixed with acoustic songs. But it does have a great Aerosmith cover, and two of the acoustic songs are good. Standout tracks, Mama Kin, Patience, Used to Love Her. Number 8, Soundgarden, Ultra Mega OK, Grade B. While this is nowhere near as good as any of the band's other albums, it is a solid debut with an almost doom metal sound on some songs. Standout tracks, Beyond the Wheel, Incessant Mace, Smokestack Lightning. Number 7, Candle Mass, Ancient Dreams, Grade B+. Another very good album with Messiah Markelin's almost operatic vocals over doom metal riffs. Standout tracks, Mirror Mirror, Ancient Dreams, Bell of Acheron. Number 6, King Diamond, Them, Grade B+. Another very good horror-themed concept album. This one would be followed by a sequel continuing this story of a fictionalized King Diamond and his grandmother. Every song in this album must be listened to to hear the whole story. Number 5, George Thurgood and the Destroyers, Born to be Bad, Grade A-. Even without any original songs to match up to his earlier classics, this album is full of great covers of songs originally by Elmore James, Chuck Berry, Howlin' Wolf, and other blues and country artists. Standout tracks, Highway 49, Shake Your Money Maker, You Can't Catch Me, Smokestack Lightning, I'm Moving On. Number 4. Megadeth, So Far, So Good, So What? Grade, A-. minus. Not quite as good as the first two Megadeth albums, but still a great album even if the cover of the Sex Pistols' Anarchy in the UK isn't very good at all. Standout tracks, Set the World Afire, Mary Jane, 502, and My Darkest Hour. Number 3, St. Vitus, Mournful Cries, Grade, A. Another great doom metal album, with singer Scott Wino Reinrich, even if it doesn't quite match up to Born Too Late. Standout tracks, The Creeps, Dragon Time, Shooting Gallery, Bitter Truth, The Troll, Looking Glass. Number 2, Metallica, and Justice For All, Grade A+. Even after the tragic death of bassist Cliff Burton, Metallica continues on with the band's fourth classic album in a row, even if new bassist Jason Newstead can barely be heard at all. Standout tracks, Blackened, Injustice for All, Eye of the Beholder, The Shortest Straw, Harvester of Sorrow, The Freight Ends of Sanity, Dyer's Eve. Number 1, Danzig, Danzig, Grade A+. Former Misfits singer Glenn Danzig sounds like Jim Morrison fronting Black Sabbath on this all-time classic debut album. Standout tracks, Twist of Cain, Not of This World, she Rides, Am I Demon, Mother.